good morning. She's got the little happy taps. Hey, no, Nanny. Oh my gosh. Push him back, Isaac. He'll become a stomach. Dude, look at this. Ooh, okay. That's so freaking cool. Not a cape, a cliff. Oh, freak. Huh? Oh, Bro. Oh, I just slipped. Look. That's cool. You can kind of see. Okay, okay, okay. Wow. Wow. There's the ladder I just came down that also is uh, starting to break. And there's Agatha, also <laughs> starting to break. <laughs> wow, a waterfall. Here's what we risk getting stuck down here for. That's what I just came down. And now I'm at the bottom. At least I think I am. Look at this. Look how freaking beautiful that is. Dude, look what I just climbed down to. Holy shoot. Oh my gosh, hold on. Holy crap, this is beautiful. And then... I'm giving in to having soggy shoes and I'm sad. Ugh, I don't even know if these are gonna dry before I can... Ugh. Now I'm sad. This is my worst nightmare. Ugh. I mean, I didn't say that. Look at them. Oh, my nice shoes. My nice Brooks. It's okay. I'm really not upset about the shoes because I'm in Brazil in basically the jungle going to a waterfall and it's an experience, you know, and they'll dry out. So it's, it's fine. It's just, I need them to dry before I fly back home. <laughs> perfect flower. It's so pretty. And now I feel like I'm back in Rio again with my soggy socks and shoes. Bro, who'd have thunk that I'd be in Brazil going through a jungle at some point in my life? Not I, buckaroo. Not I. Seriously. If you had told me two years ago when I graduated high school, I would go and be in Brazil for six weeks by myself with really no, nothing that uh, would make the trip easier. Like, I'm not fluent in Portuguese. Uh, I haven't, I don't have any experience being a missionary. Haven't gone to any other countries. I have nothing that suggests that I should do this. You had told me I would you in Brazil going through a jungle right now? I'd call you crazy. I'm gonna take you on what I'm walking through. So we're gonna... That's where I came from. Where we came from. And now where we're going. I'm gonna walk like this. Right. Whoa. 
jumping snakes. <laughs> I don't know if you can actually tell, or I don't know if this is actually a good angle, but. Oh. Oh. Bro, oh my God. This is freaking wild. Oh, oh my gosh, dude crazy. I can't believe it. And look at my little toes. Nice and soggy, but it's worth it. <laughs> this is ridiculously beautiful. Oh my gosh. to the forest we go.
I'm going to go swim some more. Bye. I literally just swam in one of God's wonders. All right, say goodbye. We're racing daylight to make it back up. So, and uh, the ladder was breaking when we were coming down. So pray for us. My mic wasn't working for some reason. It probably had water in it. So I'm gonna tell you what I was saying. I was talking about how us getting out of the ravine was really a God thing because uh, I climbed up out of the ladder first and it was broken in at least three to five different places and there was six of us that had to climb out and with each person it cracked and broke even more and so if we didn't believe in God we would not have made it out because there is no reason that that ladder should have survived and um yeah, it, it's incredible that we made it out, especially because it would have been a real bad situation had we not. So, amen. That to me. Wow. I look fabulous. Hello. Oh, he's an old boy. Hey, oldie. Oh, hello. Aw, they're cute. Oh, that one's feeling excluded. He came to join.